a more abstract problem. Um, it's a second-degree polynomial, and I'm going to factor it. And factoring this thing, I'm just going to you know, factor by grouping. There's not much choice on it. And what do I get over there? Well, first step would be group the first two terms, and you get x, and I would give you x minus a. And then I'd, gr I'd group the second two terms, and i pull a b out, and what do you get? You would get, let's see, you'd get x minus a. Let's just check that. You do get x squared minus ax. You do get bx minus ab. This is looking good. Let's keep going. Next thing to do is factor out a common factor, which is x minus a. And then what do you get? You get x plus b. What I'm going to do now, set the factors equal to 0. So x minus a equals 0. Or x plus b equals 0. This means x equals a, or x equals minus b. Let's just get our red pen out and check it. Did we get these answers? Yep, we got them. Again, it's quadratic. We're expecting to find two roots to the problem. Thank you.